Hello there, welcome back to Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Last time we explored the area of surrounding Rambler's Reach a bit. Well, at least what we could right now. And... Found an upgrade for BD, and oh, there's a... One of them droids. Where's it going? No! It's going away. Give me that. Oh, wrong button. Okay. Where are you going? Let's take this to Domas. <laughs> Who is this? Turkle's shiny shell. Outpost residents will rarely attest to Turgle's elation at having found a particularly remarkable shell and his subsequent despair at having lost it. This appears to be that shell, though. It is by no means provable nor worthy of further investigation. That looks like I can get in there. Okay, there's nothing in here. Hmm. Ah, up there. I'm just... I just like all the exploring what to do here. There's a cave. Ooh, what is this? This is strange. I think I saw these in one of the gameplay trailers. Four stairs. Oh, what is that one? Sweet. I'm gonna wait till this one comes by. Turds. Ah. Crud. It went out of sync on that one. I have a habit of just throwing myself at walls sometimes. Dagnabbit. Ah! It switches. longer Haha <laughs> Yeah What is 
what does that do? What does it give me? I don't know. Ah, really. That's a good point. There's an echo in the force, but wounded, fragmented. I was missing something. Whatever I did, it seems to have helped. Nice. Oh. Hmm. Hello, droid. I see you over there. I'll cut your throat. I hear you. The <laughs> Saying a B1 battle droid can go up against a Rancor? I don't think so. Oh, it's over there. I think. The bowling green. Am I going to skills? I think this includes my guard meter. Yeah. So I need to get over there. I'm just going to... Enemy visual confirmed. Try me again. Tactical pants. There's nothing over here. Okay. See that up there? I don't know if I can reach that though. Let's see that prime rate shard. Nope. Got a block. Got to block. Hey, BD. Boom. I wonder if when it turns blue and it's about to roll, I can push it the other direction. The 
The large, thick, hided bile mall has made a home of most Kobo's many crags, caves, and crevices. When disturbed, they react fiercely with kicks, bites, spits, and charges. Their hard exterior is resistant to most conventional weaponry. But there are several more tender spots that can be exploited. Right like their sides, instead of just smacking them in the face. Something over there. Aha. We can trade this at Doma shop. Nope. Dang damn it. There we go. More health. Just what I needed. I don't think I can make the jump right now. Have to wait till later. Think those droids are different. Hello. He tripped. Yeah, let's see. As the backbone of the Separatist infantry, B-1 battle droids are typically outfitted with standard E-11 blaster rifles. The B-1 droids of Kobo, however, can often be found wielding makeshift batons and reconfigured tactical programming. In this way, the Bedlam Raiders created a more irregular threatening army, while also compensating for munitions lost during the Luker Hulk's long rest in the Kobo Swamp. Right. Is there anything over here? There is! This is a nice one. Hey guys, how's it going? Won't save you, Jedi. Boring. Slippery. There we go. Just had to get into the rhythm of it. These raiders are keeping the Empire at bay. At least they're good for something. I wonder if 10 is the max stems you can get in this game as well. Looks well, like it opened to a completely new biome. I don't said forest, but go from like not their wasteland to in here. The array should be out here somewhere. Forest. The forward is to cut through. What the heck are those? You catch that too, BD? They're not alone out here. Okay. I mean, it activate that just yet. Looks like it's blocked. Sit tight, PD. Let me see what I can do. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, this is a good find. Death of Mirian. Good to go, BD. Let's try that again. Hmm. 
of these rock columns are loose. Huge pillars of brittle heavy rock populate the basalt forest. Seismic activity deep beneath the planet's crust unroots these stone trees, forcing the structures to erupt in their fully grown form while the stone is no longer growing. Its porous surface provides a scaffolding for rudimentary organic life forms to take root. Scholars refer to these structures as stone sentinels. This array is, buddy. Centauri Kree said I held the key to Tantalor. Z seems to think so, too. Only one way to find out. Indeed. Empire. Imperials. I don't think they saw us. Let's move. Over here, no, 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 no. Ah, go to meditation point. I need to focus. I want to check out my perks as well. Yeah, here's my block meter as well. Raiders don't like the imps any more than we do. I'm gonna switch to just single blade for a little bit. Shot this drop pod all the way from the Lucre Hulk. Drop pod from a Lucre Hulk class battleship used to transport battle droids and other separatist forces to the field during the Clone Wars. Destination coordinates typically ensure safe landings, but this pod was overridden and fired in the general area of the Basalt Rift. And these are a new type of stormtroopers. Shield troopers are deployed wherever the Empire needs to put down insurrections. They are armed with batons and heavy shields, and there are few insurgents who can penetrate their defenses or stand against their brutal, brutal strikes. Brutal. Take out the blaster one first. Watch out! He's dead. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's back up to kill you. <laughs> nice. Generations of Raka raised their young here, and the Empire tore through, shot and trampled anything that got in their way. Raka are aggressive, belligerent creatures, never more so than when defending their nest. This forest variant incubates their eggs for a dozen Kobo moon cycles. And each member defends the clutch as if it was their own. This generation of eggs, however, did not survive the planet's harsh realities. Those droids? Ow. 
Ooh, let's move. Damn it, it's hard to get those blocks right sometimes. Find something? Biomall's Revenge. Biomalls have a notoriously bad temper, often trampling, crushing, or pulverizing those caught in their rampage. Even trained Imperial soldiers stand little chance against a Biomall defending its den. We're locked out. Ah, the Hunter Pants. Oh, ho. This is when at an angle slides back in, looks like. No, where are you going? Before she was damaged, there's no way Z could have made this journey. Yeah, probably not. Kree's day, there was no empire to contend with. What I would give to see a glimpse of that galaxy. All right, I'm gonna call an episode here. Next time, we'll pick up exploring here, around in the forest, and try to make it to the array. But until then, have a great night. See y'all next time.